I got a call from a certain Henry homeowner. Circuit detective here. You short him, we sort him. Hey, Larry. Um, look, I've got some trouble over here. Some lights and outlets went out, and now my wife will be home in two hours, and I know she's going to blame me. Why would she blame you? Well, she knows I've done some rewiring around here. She's just going to blame me and want an electrician to come in here and fix things. I asked if he had checked the circuit breakers. I made it clear to him that you can't judge a breaker by how it looks. That you have to push each one very hard off before you reset it to on. Okay. Um, I, I've gone and reset all the breakers and there's no change. Now, maybe one of those outlets with the little push-button thingy on it's gone bad. A GFI? I doubt it. They only kill power when they're working. Besides, they're mostly for outlets, and you've got lights out, too. Then what's wrong? Well, I'd say you have a poor connection somewhere along that circuit. So how do I find that? Well, let's try the jiggle method. The jiggle method? What's that? Well, the idea is to try to disturb a poor connection back into working for a moment. Here's what I want you to do. Find a table lamp and uh, turn it on. Then unplug it so it'll work the instant you plug it into a good outlet. Only I want you to plug it into one of your bad outlets. Okay, I can do that. I waited while Henry got a lamp and plugged it in. I told him an old-style bulb in the lamp is better than a fluorescent. Okay, I'm all set. Now what? First you need a way to keep track of whether your lamp ever flickers on for a split second or more. Is there anyone at home with you that can watch that lamp like a hawk? Yeah, my kids, but they don't know about this little outage and I don't want them spilling the beans to their mom, you know what I mean? Okay, then you're the man, um, so you'll want to get an extension cord plugged in instead of the lamp. And then the lamp plugged into the cord so you can take the lamp around with you so you can see if it flickers on for just a second while you're jiggling. Okay, I'm ready. Now what you do is take something else that'll plug in uh, Another lamp, a coffee grinder, or a night light, and I don't care if it's turned on or not. Take this around to each of the dead outlets, and as you plug into them, wiggle the end of the cord from side to side a little bit. If the lamp you're dragging around with you ever flashes on or stays on, then, then the bad connection is at the outlet that you were just jiggling. Okay, cool. I'll try that. Yeah, Larry, um, nothing happened. Well, don't worry, there's more you can do. Think about other outlets in the area, especially ones that are maybe closer to the breaker panel than these dead ones. Go and do the jiggle in them now. Are you saying that a bad connection can be in an outlet that works? You're catching on, Watson. Think about it. If a wire that's to feed on from a working outlet is poorly connected there, it will affect only the things that it's supposed to feed. Okay. Yeah, Larry, uh, your special jiggle method is not working. Well, it, it doesn't always work, but we're not quite done. There's more 
wiggling that you can do at the switch boxes or even the light boxes. In the same general area of the dead items and toward the panel, uh, take the covers off of switches and try to disturb the wires behind the switches by poking at them uh, with something non-conductive like a wood dowel or a chopstick. I'll wait. Larry, you won't believe this. I was poking behind a switch for the hallway light, which works, and the, my sidekick, the lamp, came on. Well, I, I believe it, Henry. Uh, so now, turn all your breakers off, uh, loosen that switch up, and redo the connections in that switch box. Any wires that are connected to the switch, plus any connected in the colorful plastic wire nuts that hold those wires together. And that'll do it, Henry. You sure? You sound like we're all done. Don't leave me. Well, yes, I'm afraid there are others who need me more than you now, Henry. Uh, you'll be just fine. Okay, detective. That was great. Thanks. Sure, and if your wife needs to know anything, tell her I don't think it was your fault. It was just an electrical fault. Hey, thanks. Goodbye. Goodbye, Henry.